Good morning, everybody. Good afternoon, depending on where you're at. Uh, thank you for joining us today for the Bartender Cloud webinar. A couple of quick housekeeping items before we get started. Um, this webinar is being recorded. All registrants will get a link to the recording in the thank you note shortly after the broadcast, and we'll be placing the recording onto our website as well as our YouTube channel. Please submit any questions via the dashboard. Um, they will be answered. If not during the webinar, then we will reach out to you afterwards to make sure that you got all your questions answered. Um, and as always, if you still have questions, feel free to reach out to your account team. Um, this webinar, we're going to try something new. Um, we'll be doing a few live polls throughout the event to help us gain more insight into specific use cases and, and our users. Thank you in advance for your participation. And please, if you haven't already, use the bartender portal to opt into our emails. You can click on the Your Info section and select the dial and save. And then we are doing our best to make Bartender the absolute easiest and best product, the team, as well as the company to work with. Um, take a minute to let us know if you agree via the survey at the end of the event. Next slide, please. Let me officially welcome you to the Bartender Cloud new product announcement webinar for the United States market. I'm Carolyn McLeod, your MC for today, and I'm part of the global marketing team here at Siegel. I've been marketing for a few minutes now, and I'm psyched to be working on my first cloud product and in particular with this specific team. It's an honor to introduce you to the brilliant Mike Leo, our director of product marketing, who will be taking us through the product today, as well as our newest team member, the hilarious Chris Orr. He is the sales engineering director, uh, the global technical lead of um, all of our people ca that can answer all of our questions. Um, and Chris will be taking us through the demo. So let's get started. Mike, let me hand it off to you. Awesome, thank you, uh, Carolyn. Thank you to uh, everyone for taking the time this morning to attend our webinar. I'm really happy to be here to tell you about our newest product offering, Bartender Cloud. I'll start by giving you a quick review of what we've accomplished this year, including Bartender Cloud. And as mentioned, Chris Orr will then be giving a live demo of Bartender Cloud. So a quick note for anyone that's not familiar with us, we're uh, Siegel Scientific, makers of bartender software. Our company has been has over 35 years of rich history in barcode reading, label design and printing, printer drivers and integration. We are a global company with regional support centers that provide 24 by seven follow the sun support. You know Bartender as the leading software label management solution. Uh, Bartender is much more than design and print. Bartender helps our customers to simplify and automate their labeling processes so they can create, manage, and print labels, RFID tags, and documents with ease. Bartender can help businesses simplify their inventory management, accelerate the pack-in process, and reduce warehouse management costs. Bartender reduces downtime, eliminates label inefficiency, and maximizes printing performance. Our customers come in all sizes, from small to large across all industries. It is estimated that 70% of enterprise labeling occurs in the manufacturing, warehouse, and logistics space. Our customers use Bartender there as well as a number of vertical specific applications. Businesses use Bartender to ensure that the right goods get to the right location. What they all have in common is the desire to improve labeling practices to reduce costs, accelerate logistics, meet regulatory, regulatory requirements, and to track, trace, and manage what matters. Today, we have over 100,000 customers around the world printing over 40 billion labels per year. 
Bartender's Advantages has made it the number one label management solution in the world. Most important, Bartender is easy to use, yet powerful and flexible in its range of integration possibilities. With Bartender, our customers have reduced their IT costs and reduced the risk of label errors. We are the only label management software company with global services and support, with support staff in five key geographic locations around the world. This includes the east and west coast of the US. There is no one else in the industry who has the volume of staff to provide effective 24 by seven customer support. Also, we are very proud that we are the number one Gartner recommended label management solution and that all of the Gartner top 25 supply chain and top 25 healthcare supply chain organizations all use Bartender. At Siegel, we have always been in the forefront of technology. We pride ourselves on being customer focused, delivering solutions that our customers can easily use to meet their needs. Bartender is known for ease of use. We have been first to market with many innovative features such as intelligent templates and RFID support. We provide the most database connectors. Customers can easily connect to over 20 different databases and data file types. One of our key competitive advantages is our integration platform that allows customers to integrate with their ERP, WMS, MES, and any business application without any programming. Bartender is also a critical component for our customers for compliance with regulatory and industry standards. We've been a long time leader in this area. GS1 Digital Link is the next evolution of barcodes and e-labeling. Seagull was chosen by the GS1 organization to be the launch partner for GS1 Digital Link. Finally, we support the most label printers in the world with nearly 8,000 specific printer drivers that provide optimized high performance printing, almost 100% more than our nearest competitor. This year was an even busier year with major new product announcements. We started the year with our latest Bartender software release, Bartender 2022. Bartender 2022 made it even easier to print from anywhere with remote web printing in our improved print portal application and from the factory floor with our new print station application. We added to our extensive list of database connectors with support for SAP HANA databases. And finally, we further extended our integration platform with a new REST API that gives customers access to all the Bartender integration builder actions via a standard web-based API. We're the only major labeling solution provider with a full REST API support. With our three drivers by Siegel releases in 2022, we added support for an additional 630 printers with a total of nearly 8,000 drivers now. In addition to major printer manufacturers, we also added support for domino laser printing and marking systems, opening up a whole new uh, area of a support for us. We also extended our RFID capabilities with support for the unique tag ID or TID of each RFID chip. This will help customers increase security and reduce counterfeiting. Last but not least, we then released our new Bartender mobile app this summer. We're the only major labeling solution provider to provide native Android and iOS apps for printing from your mobile devices. We've had over 25,000 downloads to date as bartender customers use our mobile app to print at their source of work, reducing unnecessary steps and cost, as well as increasing label accuracy. Hey Mike, let's do a quick poll, uh, our first one. Hang on, let me get it going. All right, everyone, if you would uh, just take a minute to answer what sort of labeling solution you're currently using today. We'll give it another minute. People are still voting. <clears throat> Interesting. 
Okay, very good. Give it one more minute, just about everybody's voted. This is fantastic. Thank you so much. All right, looks like most everybody is using um, Bartender on-premise. All right, great. Uh, let's see. So are we back to the slides or? All right, okay. All right, and now today, I'm proud to announce our newest, newest product release this year, Bartender Cloud. As I mentioned, we've always looked to where our customers' needs are. Many of them are looking at digital transformation of their IT and labeling infrastructure. They are seeing clear advantages with the cloud with 87% accelerating their migration to the cloud, especially coming out of the recent pandemic and its wide ranging impact. 80% of companies see operational improvements in areas where they are adopting the cloud. And there is transformational change in IT spending as 41% of total IT spending has shifted from traditional hardware and software to the cloud. The time is right for taking the leading labeling solution to the cloud. Bartender Cloud is the easiest way to simply print your labels without the need to install and maintain your own IT hardware and software. Bartender Cloud is not just a copy of Bartender software hosted in the cloud. It's our new next generation software platform designed to be a true multi-tenant software as a service. Bartender Cloud is an on-demand laboring resource available when you need it. For a simple annual subscription fee, an unlimited number of users in your organization can print to any number of printers. Bartender Cloud works with our new mobile app, and there is no printer driver management required. The most trusted labeling solution, Bartender, is now available in the cloud. With Bartender Cloud, there are six basic feature areas and benefits. First, number one, all authorized users will have access to a centrally stored uh, label templates. They can easily print from any browser or mobile device from any location. Number two, to create label templates, Bartender Cloud customers can access the Bartender Cloud template library with hundreds of commonly used label templates available, or they can let our label designs team design a label for them. Number three, Customers can then easily connect their data using our template assistant with the Bartender Cloud template library templates with guided steps to connect their label to any cloud database along with adding data entry forms or embedded data. Existing Bartender customers can also upload any label templates created in Bartender Designer. All the great label design and formatting features, including intelligent templates and RFID can be printed from Bartender Cloud. Number four, customers can integrate to their ERP, WMS, MES, and business applications through our Bartender REST API or file drop integration method. Number five, customers can manage their security and their entire system, including role-based access. And finally, number six, all this is available as a reliable and secure on-demand cloud-based service. Let me tell you a little bit more about what makes it the cloud. Bartender Cloud is not just about hosting the current bartender software in the, in the cloud. We've built a new next generation labeling platform. Bartender Cloud has been designed using the latest cloud and computing technologies. It's a new architecture implemented as a true multi-tenant platform in the cloud. Bartender Cloud provides a high 99.9% .9 high service availability. This equates to just about 44 minutes per, per month of downtime. The architecture includes customers being deployed across multiple redundant clusters of nodes, not just a single server, with full data replication and continuous data backup with automated failover. This modern computing and networking architecture also automatically scales, base, scales capacity based on demand. Bartender Cloud's architecture also has security designed in 
This includes layered security controls, including physical and logical, technical and administrative layers, which have been designed to protect customer data and reduce overall risk. Finally, Bartender Cloud is hosted on Amazon Web Services or AWS. AWS delivers the highest network availability of any cloud provider. AWS also supports more security standards and compliance certifications than any other infrastructure as a service offering. So, how are customers using Bartender Cloud? We're seeing widespread adoption of Bartender Cloud. Customers are looking to centralize and standardize their labeling operations across many of our traditional market segments. Many customers are looking at basic product identification and license plate labeling use cases that are a great fit for Bartender Cloud. We see customers like a nationwide coffee distributor with retail stores around the country who wanted to centralize their labeling operations. We also saw two new manufacturers one with manufacturing in China, where they were having issues with label accuracy with their vendor printing the wrong labels. And we also had a manufacturer here in the U.S. with their own production, facil production facilities, where they have a very unskilled print oper set of print operators. All these manufacturers, all these customers are looking to bartender cloud. Here's a more detailed look at the six Bartender Cloud feature areas. As I mentioned, Chris will be giving a more in-depth look at each of the features uh, after me with his live demo. For now, I'm just gonna highlight some of the more unique features for each, for each of these areas as shown in the green text. When we say Bartender Cloud is simple and easy to print, we're referring to Bartender Intelligent Printing. Bartender Cloud supports printing to any printer. Users on a Windows PC and laptop or from the new Bartender mobile app will have connected printers automatically discovered and an optimized high performance print job sent to the printer using one of the nearly 8,000 Seagull printer drivers. For unrecognized printers, a PDF will be streamed for printing. The end user does not need to install or manage any of these print drivers. This is all happening in Bartender Cloud. Another great feature is the Bartender template library. Many of the hundreds of commonly used templates will have a template assistant built in that walks a user step-by-step -step to connect their label to Excel Online or Google Sheets and auto mapping their data fields to their data entry form. And for when we say powerful, the Bartender REST API expands the Action APIs introduced with Bartender 2022 software with additional printing, librarian document management, and security APIs. We've also greatly expanded documentation and included a sample app to demonstrate the librarian and security API, as well as a file drop web application. All of this is available on our next generation cloud platform on demand for when you need it. Bartender cloud pricing is unique and pretty simple. We believe that customers will want to purchase their labeling on demand or as they need it. This has been the general trend in IT for, the, for the past 15 years. Just as Amazon Web Services popularized purchasing server or computing capacity by the hour, we believe that many customers will purchase labeling by the number of labels that they print. Bartender Cloud is available in two plans. Customers basically pick the plan and then the label volume printing tier. The Essentials plan provides two gigabytes of storage and essential support while the automation plan bumps storage up to five gigabytes and adds the Bartender REST API and file drop integration capabilities, as well as providing standard support. Automation plan customers can also add on premium 24 by seven support. There's a one-time provisioning charge, which includes two label designs provided by our label design team, for a limited time during this year until December the 31st, we'll look to design any, any commonly used label templates for no additional charge so that we can build up the template library. Every plan also includes our new customer success program where our team walks you through starting up and using your Bartender Cloud account. Bartender Cloud, as I mentioned, includes extensive help resources with integrated online help, 
These help resources are also available on our support site. On the support site, in addition to the bartender documentation, there is also extensive resources, including product videos and full documentation of the Bartender Cloud REST API. So finally, before I turn it over to uh, Chris for his uh, live demo, as I mentioned, Bartender Cloud is not a replacement for Bartender software. We're seeing customers use one or the other, as well as both. It all depends on your labeling needs. Here's a quick guide to determine which bartender solution is the best fit, whether it's bartender cloud or bartender software or a hybrid model with both solutions. On the left here, for bartender customers, the biggest consideration that we've heard is the desire by customers to move to the cloud so that they do not have to install and manage their own IT hardware and software. Many companies, especially small and mid-sized companies, have limited IT resources. In many cases, Customers want to centralize and standardize their printing, especially if it involves multiple company locations or external suppliers and partners. They see, a cloud, they see the cloud as a way to more efficiently manage their labeling operations and associated staff. We also expect that customers remote, with remote or field operations will like the ability to use the new Bartender mobile app to print from the cloud. With the Bartender Cloud template library available, we also see customers who only need commonly used labels and not custom designed labels being a good fit. For hybrid customers in the middle here who have bartender software already, they can add and use bartender cloud for temporary seasonal or unplanned printing volume, right? If they add a new customer, they can easily extend printing to external supplier labeling locations. In both cases, they do not need to install additional bartender software. They don't need to install an additional print portal server. And finally, in the third column here, for bartender customers, bartender software customers, they will have available IT resources. They will want to install and manage their own IT software and hardware. And in many cases, they will have a variety of custom label designs. And they will also like to take advantage of more advanced capabilities in terms of connecting to many different data sources, in terms of integrating to different business applications, and also taking advantage of some more advanced security and printer uh, capabilities in Bartender software itself. So I think at this time, we're going to run a, another quick poll, I think, Carolyn? Yep, here we go. When do you plan on using the cloud for your labeling printing operations? If you would take a minute to just pick one of these choices, that would be fabulous. All right. We'll just give it a few more seconds. People are still voting, so I'm gonna give them a minute. Thanks for waiting. All right, I think we're good. Um, everyone's in various stages here, very interesting. Thanks, Mike. Great, all right. So with that, I would like to turn it over now to Chris Orr, who will now give you a live demo of Bartender Cloud and its key capabilities. Let me unmute myself, thank you there, Mike. And uh, while I share my screen there, uh, we're now going to be doing uh, the going into the live demo portion of our webinar. Uh, I'll be showing you basically how easy it is to find, configure, and print a label from the Bartender Cloud uh, using the templates from our built-in library. Now, hopefully, everybody's looking at uh, 
at my web interface here. And as you can see, uh, there are three main areas uh, that we'll be uh, working in. Across the top here is a, is a menu uh, that will allow us to basically uh, navigate from uh, the print console to our ability to manage files as well as manage our cloud accounts. There is a navigation uh, tree over here on the left, as well as uh, our main area, which is the pane that will allow us to kind of organize and deal with all of our uh, folders and files that we're going to be working from. The manage cloud account is where you will be able to essentially create any number of different users that you want. I do see that as a question that had come up uh, within the uh, within the uh, uh, question chat over uh, on the on my control panel here. You can also create different groups that allow you to organize those users into sort of like the sort of areas that uh, uh, that make sense for your organization and then assign different roles. And we've got built in roles like uh, print operators and content managers and administrators and so on. Uh, the manage cloud cloud account area is also where you can track who's printing what and how many labels they've printed, as well as overall history of printing uh, that has been going on in your environment so you can track your overall usage of the product. The print console is where you will essentially be printing your labels. And then finally, manage files is where as the name implies, you can create uh, the number of different folders that you want and organize them uh, in an appropriate way, that sort of logical infrastructure uh, or your view of the world, such as location or owner or user or whatever your infrastructure or imagination requires. As Mike, Michael had mentioned, you can also, we, we do have role-based and object-based security, so you can control who can log in, what they can do, and what they can see. So essentially, for example, for a particular folder, I can um, assign uh, users to a group and then assign that group and give them permissions to uh, particular folders and show how much control they have. Do they, do they need to be able to see this? Can they edit items within here? Can they maybe delete those items? Again, depending on your particular requirements for the users that are in your environment. Once your permissions are set, we can then uh, go ahead and start creating and printing labels. So I'm gonna go ahead and drill down into this environment here, and I'm gonna go ahead and uh, create a label for us. Now, again, Siegel provides over 130, and this number is growing, templates for you to choose from. So going into our uh, bartender template library, uh, you can see here these templates range from uh, shipping and logistics to signage and uh, product labels. And because there are so many different label templates that we provide, the UI provides a search function for you that allows you to quickly find the kind of template that you want. For example, I can go ahead and log in here and uh, search for GS1. Oops, I'm sorry. <laughs> Using my cap locks there. I can search for GS1. Uh, so as, as noted, we do support GS1 labels, and we can uh, go ahead and select our GS1 uh, 128 shipping label here. And we can go ahead and go into this and begin uh, talking about the, as Mike had mentioned, the uh, template assistant. So I'm going to go ahead and give this a name here. So I'll just call this uh, shipping label. All right, and, I'll, and you can see here that this particular shipping label has a number of different fields that are associated with this particular uh, uh, item here, and we're going to go ahead and click Next. Now, if you skip the data entry section here, you'll be asked to manually enter in all of the fields that you saw on the first page, and that'll be fine for smaller data sets or ad hoc printing. However, most of us are more than likely uh, to have a lot of data records to print. So we have the ability to connect our label to a number of different uh, sources of data. So I'm gonna select a data entry forms here. We'll go ahead and click next there. Now, out of the box, uh, and this was a question that had come up in the, um, uh, in the chat there, uh, Bartender Cloud does support CSV files, and that would be something like an embedded text file. However, we also do support Excel and online, uh, Excel online and Google Sheets. We can also provide integrations with a large number of 
ERP and WM, WMS systems, which you'll see uh, later on. So we're going to go ahead and select Excel online here. Uh, we'll select our printer, uh, select our records at print time and click next here. Uh, we will, of course, be required to log into our uh, um, uh, Excel online uh, uh, account. And we'll go ahead and click next. Here we select the Excel online worksheet that we're going to be working from. And if the worksheet has more than one sheet associated with it, we go ahead and select that one as well. From here, the next few pages of the assistant are going to take us through the process of, map, of mapping the fields uh, in the label to the correct data fields in our spreadsheet. Now, we could do this manually. I can go ahead and do this on a one-by-one on one basis. However, we do have the ability to auto-map our database fields. And you'll see that we can use all of those things are go ahead are automatically done. Uh, for any of these open static text fields, we can also manually adjust them if we needed to. For example, if we had a particular suite that we wanted to add in there, like so. On the ship two, we can do the same thing. And then finally, if we want to leave things behind, uh, again, and, and uh, maybe not necessarily uh, map them to a database field, but uh, um, map them, uh, go ahead and um, enter in a static, a static string, like so, we can do so. So we'll just go ahead and accept the final items here and click Finish. Now, of course, you may not have seen, uh, you, may, you might not have seen any of the labels that you specifically want to print or none of the ones that we provided close enough. If that is the case, Siegel is currently running a limited time promotion where our label design team will create up to five common use label templates for you. Now, here we have our label. And again, I can go in here and edit the permissions on this particular item if I wanted to assign it to a particular user or prevent somebody else from accessing or, or doing anything with that label. But if I want to print it, we'll go ahead and select it and then click the print button. Now this will take us automatically to the print console. When Bartender Cloud prints, you will have access to the 8,000 some odd scientific, Siegel scientific printer drivers available for the most commonly used label printers out there. Uh, you will just have to install our lightweight printer gateway service on any PC where those printers are connected. Now here we've decided that we don't need to necessarily print all of these records. Maybe we only want to print one or two of the, of the several hundred or thousand uh, items that are in here. Uh, in this case, maybe I don't need to print, you know, labels uh, uh, or records two through uh, eight here. So I'll go ahead and deselect those. Once I've selected them, I can go ahead and click next. The record picker will now allow me to review each label. So, for example, if the address has changed, they've called us up and said, oh, yeah, you know, we need, you know, this, this uh, store number needs to be uh, 1530. So we'll go ahead and, and enter that data string in there. Or if nothing needs to be done, we'll go ahead and just click uh, next on that next one here that, that comes up on that next record. And we'll go ahead and click print. And off we go to the races. Bartender Cloud will take the, P the data provided. It will create the label and send the print job off to the printer gateway service on that PC. Now, in this case, I have printed off to PDF. So all I need to do is click uh, open here. And we can see all of the labels that we have chosen to print. At this point, I can manually send it off to my local printer if it's one that we don't uh, necessarily uh, um, have a driver for, or obviously with our 8,000 drivers, uh, we can uh, uh, send these print jobs directly to, uh, uh, to the printer as well. Now I will say this, all of the things that I've shown you here so far can also be automated using our REST API. Uh, Mike, let's go ahead and uh, uh, show them what, uh, what that looks like. I'm gonna go ahead and make you the, the presenter here. Awesome. So, all right, go ahead, Chris. Yep. So one of the things that 
that science, Siegel Scientific wanted to make sure is that the Bartender Cloud is as flexible a platform as we can make it. So using pretty much any coding or scripting language that you like, Python, Perl, C Sharp, you, you name it, um, you, can, you can use to automate or, or leverage this REST API to use. We've documented this API as, as, as thoroughly as possible to, that will allow you to pretty much pull information from and send data to a print shop. Go ahead and go to the next slide for me. For example, you can create scripts and integrations to enumerate printers, for example, uh, attached to a particular PC. You can find the label that you want to print. You can link that label to a data source and print the records that you want. And with that, I want to thank you for your attention to my demo today. And now I'm going to turn this back over to Michael. Thank you, Chris. That was a great demo. Hopefully everyone saw how easy it is to use Bartender Cloud. It's simple and uncluttered interface continues our focus and commitment on ease of use. Bartender Cloud is the easiest way for customers to simply create their labels and print all without the need for their own IT infrastructure and resources. Customers can centralize and standardize their labeling operations. And Bartender Cloud works great if you're new to labeling. It's also a great solution that works with on-premises bartender software. So with that, before I close out our presentation, I think we wanted to run one more poll. Yes, please. All right, everybody, last question. When do you plan on using the cloud for your labeling printing operations? Oh, I'm so sorry, wrong question. Does your print volume vary across or is it consistent month to month? Thanks, everybody. Just a few more seconds, we'll give people to answer. This is so incredibly helpful to us, everyone. Thanks for participating. Few more seconds. All right, sounds good, thanks. Mike? All right, great. So thank you, uh, Carolyn, for uh, trying out the new polls here. Uh, so this brings us to the end of our presentation. So let me uh, close things out and then we'll uh, open it up to our question and answer session first. I wanted to thank you again, everyone, for attending the webinar uh, this morning and giving us uh, your time and attention. I hope we were able to give you a good taste of how Bartender Cloud can transform your labeling operations and help reduce your labeling costs while helping your overall business grow. Of course, if you're interested in Bartender Cloud, it's a pretty simple process. You can contact us. Uh, at the URL that you see here listed on the slide here, or reach out to our sales team or your partner reseller sales team as well. Uh, we'll, of course, help you assess the right solution based upon your needs and schedule a Bartender Cloud demo. Uh, if appropriate, uh, we can also connect you, if you're not uh, connected already, to a certified cloud partner reseller. So with that, let us uh, switch over to your questions and answers, or questions, I guess. Yeah, well, questions and answers. Uh, this is Lee Stevens, Senior Sales Engineer, and Roberto Posada and I are going to be going through some of the questions that you folks have submitted. And so please keep them coming. And uh, Roberto, are you ready to uh, give some answers to these people? Good morning, good afternoon, depending where you're located. Thank you so much for being part of the this new product, this webinar. And I am always ready, Lee. <laughs> All Please right. stump us, yeah. <laughs> okay, well, we, I we enjoy uh, these. These me and Lee enjoy uh, questions and answers, everybody. So we, we, we do. We, we, mm -hmm. we do. And I'm going to be pitching today, and Roberto's going to be catching. 
So uh, Roberto, one of the most common questions I've been seeing is, hey, can I use my existing bartender templates in cloud? What do we say? Most definitely, everybody, you'll be able to use your bartender templates on the cloud with some limitations because if you're using Excel, you would have to use that Excel file online. You would have to go to Excel online, or if you're go, uh, using just a regular sheet, it has to be online. Other than that, um, regardless, the label should be able to upload to the cloud. Yeah, the, the one other uh, thing that you would probably want to make adjustments to is if you are referencing something that's on your local computer, guess what? In the cloud, it's gonna be a little bit hard for the bartender to know about that. So those, that would be another adjustment you would need to make. When in doubt though, contact us, we can help you work through that. There is, in most cases, these are just some small changes that you would need to make. So uh, next question I'm seeing uh, coming up a lot is, uh, questions about on-site setup and support for uh, Bartender Cloud. Uh, I would want, yeah, uh, we offer, uh, with the purchase of the product, we are helping you design your templates. We are helping you design your templates for, for the REST API as well, depending on, on the product you purchase. Um, the product comes with a, a year of support as well with the subscription, it comes with support, but. And uh, we are here to help you out with that setup, with the initial setup. As Mike Leo mentioned at the beginning, there is a fee for the setup process, and we are helping you with all of that. Yeah, so I, uh, this is Mike here. I, I'm seeing a lot of questions around the pricing. Uh, for the URL that I showed, or you can actually just go to our homepage, seagullscientific.com. Uh, we're highlighting, of course, Bartender Cloud at the top of uh, our homepage. But you can click in to learn more details about Bartender Cloud, as well as the actual pricing. Uh, so uh, I know I see a number of questions about pricing and the pricing, as I mentioned, if you go to the web page, it is based upon the number of labels that you print in a year. Uh, so it includes support for an unlimited number of printers. So the pricing model is uh, very different than bartender software. Uh, and you can see all the details uh, on the pricing web page, as I described and as mentioned, you can definitely reach out to our sales team to uh, learn more. So Roberto, um, there are a number of questions that I'm just going to kind of round up um, and say that this they're all going to be um, answerable through using the REST API and Bartender Cloud Automation. Do you want to talk about uh, our REST API and some of the uses it can be put to? So let's think about this. The bartender mantra, give me your data and we will print it for you. And REST API is what enables us to receive data from any of your business systems. So for those that are using any business system, ERP, MES, WMS, those business systems have the capability of pushing data to us through the cloud. That's why we're using REST because it's all through the internet. So using the post, we are able to consume the data that your business system is telling cloud, hey, I need you to print this label, I need these amount of copies, and this is the, uh, the pair of values that go inside of my label. Similar to the integration builder when we're doing a web service. Now think we have, an, we have this tool that is REST API that is language independent. You could code something in JSON, you could code something in CHR, um, and it's going to talk to Bartender Cloud using REST API. I don't know, I don't know if you want to expand on that, Lee. Um, no, I think you covered that part pretty well. I, you know, what I would like to point out is that through the REST API, which happens to be the same REST API that you have with the uh, bartender premise systems, uh, this is a great way to be able to develop a hybrid solution where you're doing both premise and cloud printing, each one working according to its strengths and um, what works best for you. So uh, if you have a premise bartender system and you would have a need for some of the capabilities that Bartender Cloud has, yes, we can actually help you with that and uh, help you combine both the premise and the Bartender Cloud. Uh, uh, that. Just reading a question there, and yes, um, you think about it through common line, 
you're basically sending instructions via REST to cloud, so it is doable. Yeah, and uh, I've already had a number of customers uh, that are current bartender uh, users that are uh, going down that route. So that's definitely something uh, there. Um, and just to expand on that, I'm sorry to interrupt you there, Lee. Go for it. Yes, yes. Payload data could include the template, the printer we're planning on using copies, and everything that we need could be pushed in a JSON format from your ERP to us to do something for you. Just wanted to add that because I'm, I'm seeing all of these questions coming in. Very, very <laughs> yeah. much appreciate it because, you know, we want to keep the Q&A going as, 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 as much as possible and answer all your questions because it's a new product. You want to know as much as, as possible about the product before making a purchasing decision. So here, here's a question somebody said, how do the cloud services kind of match up with that we're offering match up with the different uh, premise uh, versions that, you know, I think a lot of people are used to thinking about bartender as the automation professional enterprise, et cetera. How would you equate them? I mean, we have two cloud versions, uh, essentials and automation. What would you say is the equivalent of essentials in premise? I would say it, it is a professional. Um, in comparison, it would be a professional because you have the data entry capabilities and um, and that logic where somebody types in that information, we have the capability to connect into these databases. But yeah, up to there, because when we talk about uh, the automation aspect, we're using REST API, so that'd be more at the higher end. So you would think automation is comparable to automation on the front. Because yeah, of the capability of because of automating something without removing the human person from clicking and printing. It happens automatically based on transaction or based on something pushed from your system. Yeah. All right. I, I, so it I, looks I would like agree uh, with we that. have we we should uh, have take one more question and sort of wrap it up. Okay. Okay. So here's a great question. Based on the presentation, will we continue to support and enhance the on-premise solution? I would yeah. want Mike to answer that because it's a yes, definitely well, the on prem yeah, is never going to go away. <laughs> I, I think we can all say absolutely. As I sort of uh, described at the beginning of the presentation, Bartender Cloud is a, a new and distinct uh, product separate from a bartender software. Um, and we see a lot of use cases for existing customers to use Bartender Cloud in conjunction with Bartender Software. Moving forward, we're going to see customers again based upon our customers requirements they're going to use bartender software or bartender cloud where it fits so we actually uh, are not forcing our customers to um, give up on their software and strictly move to the cloud we actually again um, are driven by what our customers needs and how we can best meet those needs yeah and and to reinforce what mike says it's the right tool for the right uh challenge and there are things that premise can do that only a premise solution can really perform well. Likewise, there are things that only a cloud solution can perform really well. With Siegel, we're focused on providing a bartender environment that allows you to construct the solution that works for you, not forcing you to work around us. So, um, Roberta, you have any last thoughts? No, we're all excited. The cloud is a, it's a, it's a new product very powerful rest api gives you that power um and it's helping you transform your labeling and grow with your business just like lee says we adapt to what you need so awesome all right well thank you again everyone for attending and uh we'll look forward to uh talking with you all in the future thanks everybody thank you everyone thank you everyone thank you